walk by faith. What is it? To trust in him. What's the what's the path? We walk by faith and not by sight. Not by sight. What, what is, is that? that? Is he, what is that? That's uh, we just did that one today. It's the um, it's, what's uh, the verse on it. Hold on. We, well, well, the, the, we can know the verse. I want the meaning. What, what what does that mean to you? To walk by faith, not by sight. Like, walk believing, not knowing what's going to happen. We're kind of doing that in this, pro do, in do, this do, program. Do, is right do we have a blind faith? No. That basis of. Like to believe without seeing, you know? We never, we don't know what's gonna happen. Yeah, I don't know So, so, well, this is the eyes of your faith, right here. Yeah, this cross is the eyes of your faith. You walk by faith and not by sight. Right. So, you're walking by the work that he's done on the cross. Why are you walking by faith of the work he did on the cross? Because you weren't there when he did it. Right? right? We weren't there when he did it. So I'm going to walk by faith that what he did is true. Because he is true. And he accomplished something for me. So I'm living my life by the fact that what he did has made me right with God. And I'm forgiven once and for all. So I'm walking by faith in what he's done. I have a relationship with God. I'm no longer a sinner. But I'm holy and righteous and accepted in His sight. That's walking by faith and not by sight. Because to walk by sight is to, is to walk by what I'm doing or I examine what, how I'm living and the way I'm doing things. No, no, no. I'm not accepted by what I do. I'm accepted by what He's done. So my forgiveness is predicated on the cross of what He's done. Not about how good I am, how bad I am, that God is forgiving me. As a matter of fact, when you go to God and ask God to forgive you, how is that so? How is he going to forgive you? Has he already forgiven you? Or does he forgive you when you ask for it? He's already, he's already done it. He's already done Based it. Based on the cross. Based on the cross. So I'm, I'm, not, I'm not asking him to do something that he's already done. So, so, how so why do we have to repent then? No, I I mean, it's a stupid question. No, it's basically not. to your logic, though. No, if we're already forgiven, then why do we have to get on our knees and ask to be forgiven? Yes, good question. I mean, I I'm gonna ask for forgiveness because that's what I told him supposed to do. But why? <laughs> why? 